And welcome to Elders Eldersley Reserves. I'll get that eventually. Uh, joined by Tristan Stasevich. How are you, Tristan? Good, Milky. Good to be back. That's uh, always good. I missed you last week, mate. I missed you. <laughs> and we've got a blast from the past. The uh, best stats man in the business. Couldn't make it, so we got Phil Shaw. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, mate. I've, shake, I've shake, uh, shaken, is that the word? Off all the commitments today, mate, just to free up for this. Yeah, up, the, up they go. Jai Sheen in the ruck, which is interesting for, for uh, Newtown. Ball comes out. Leading in the race is uh, Marcus Crooks with the beard. Seems to be the thing of the go. Jared Garner gets the ball. Kicking to the advantage of sort of downhill and with the wind, the Colac Tigers. Newtown. Oh, mark. good mark. Come taken by Luke Forbes. Right on the arc. That big looping left foot calls. Call, he knows he can't make the distance. Calling for someone to deliver it to. It's a good kick oh, and beautiful. a good take. That's um, a good mark there to your, your uh, Bill Lurry. Doesn't look, any, forward. doesn't look anything like Bill Lurry, because if that was the real Bill Lurry, his schnoz would be just visible <laughs> from here. <laughs> There'd be pigeons perched on it. Yep. That was a terrific, uh, terrific kick from uh, Forbes when he's a quality footballer. In he comes, Bill Lurry. Goal umpire Ooh. runs to her right. I think that is a her. Yeah, it is too. We got, do we get chick goal umpires for the day, boys? We do, I mate. So. There we go. Take the right on, right up with everything, don't I? There's probably some significance for that. They <laughs> coming, coming out of uh, is Ryan Monaghan puts it into the centre of the ground, picked up by no, it wasn't. I thought it was Seal, but it wasn't. It was Caden Newton. Gone forward, Newtown. Oh, Oban takes the mark for Collick in the back pocket. Where you go, Tristan? Oban now looks to go short. Finds Kelly at about centre half back. He's oh, called to play on. He's wrapped up by Corey. Umpire says holding the ball, but he wants to call it back, even though Tyler George, oh, no. The post. Good call, umpire. Good call up. <laughs> <laughs> so, yes. the ex-Cat playing his second game for Newtown. Looks like he's going to have a shot at goal early on in the piece today. As Pull your shorts up, son. It looks as though the wind's just dropped off slightly as this it game's got it? underway. We and actually uh, felt the, a waft of it coming at us, which yeah. was blowing over our shoulder and dead in that bottom pocket. So a nice solid start here for Newtown. Oh, no, I can't see anything to give us an indication. Oh, he's got the big beard going on too. And the port, look at the shorts. He's got the low hanging shorts. He's got the Harper shorts on. Uh, Just a hipster from way back. Don't he since, you know, <laughs> married into, he married into Tom Veal's family, you know yeah, that. That's yeah, right. He claims him, don't worry about that. Corey now puts it on the boot. Doesn't quite make the distance. Can't take the grab down there as Hocking. Ball comes to ground. Forbes is in after it. Going in there is Kolak. Uh, Kelly gets it out. Gets it over to Crooks. Crook gets it on his left boot. Comes out to Learson. Learson oh. somehow uh, nearly takes it on the grab. But Perkins there to mop up for Newtown. He's got numbers everywhere. And he finds McCorkle in the pocket. Tough shot from there. But the skipper's got it in his hands as he weighs up his options in the Ford 50. But a promising start for Newtown. Absolutely. Really important that they get yeah, the good goals start. on the board, though. Wasn't and if whisper, you got it, sorry. Wasn't the whisper that McCorkle was going back today? He's that's his no, brother. That's his Ashes fullback. Okay. Yep. If um, he's probably in the best spot to, to kick it if he goes outside the, the right post. Yeah, go Puts on. it on his boot just straight across the face yep. and out of bounds. No, nah, snuck it in for a point. Snuck it in for a point. Behind Jared McCorkle. All right. Doing the kicking duties is Simpkin. Uh, gets it out to his teammate. Monaghan. Mona Mona's the call. He's at half back. Probably the back colleague's best at the moment, I reckon. This season gone so far. Learson's a target. Gets it at gra ground level almost. Picked off by Jared Garner. Oh, Learson and his teammate oh. there in Simpkin. They, they're wrestling for it. Kicks it over into the bounce. Uh, Baxter, who had just come back from a hamstring. Probably a bit uh, suspect about bending down for those. Pouch. Oh, sorry, pouch. <laughs> <laughs> Baxter hasn't missed a game. Oh, there you go. <laughs> they sound the same, Basically, don't they? Yeah, they both yeah. start with B. That's yeah. right. I was listening at least. <laughs> <laughs> Ball gets thrown in into the 50. Nice throw in by the umpire there. Comes to ground. McMahon's there. Tyler oh, George going work. in after it. it. In there is Monaghan, as we know he does. Baxter's in after it as well. Learson goes at, goes at it. And it's bustled over the line there by McCorkle. About 55 out from goal scoreboard side for Trying Newtown. To, every time Leeson's gone for it, there's been three Newtown players near him. I think his name would have been pretty yeah. firmly on that <laughs> yes. board. And uh, he's last time these two play, he was best on by a mile. Veal sling, slings his opponent out of the way. Gets a handball. Monaghan. Sorry, that was Simpkin. Over the top to Kelly in a run. Stands his ground. Goes to the left. A shocking kick. Picked off by Sheehan. 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 
happy not Jack has that gone over the boundary line? I thought of that. Yep. We'll have a boundary throw in. Just, yeah, just. Just to the, the beauty of the monitors, yeah. mate. Yeah. <laughs> McVillie and Kelly going at it. Probably about their 15th time in their careers. They've probably played against each other one-on-one. -on -one. Ball gets tossed back in. Veal gets to the front. Falls to Crooks. He gets it forward. Going now. Sheehan leads the race out and he gets onto it. Nice low pass out to uh, Laurie. Laurie can't trap it. So he comes to Forbes. Gets on his left boot. Bit of a deflection there as Buchanan. No, sorry. Fedley gets it. He chips out. He looks for Lynch. Lynch... Stop some props and there goes Wider. Finds the reason Newton. T-Bird's not here anymore, Lynch. Yeah, yeah that's <laughs> right. Newton goes down the line looking for Carmody. He can't bring it in. Braddock gets his hands on the oh. footy and now they're away. They've got Tyler George. Just slams it on his boot to one on one with Forbes. He gets Ooh, fouled bad. when he gets it, but Laurie gets it front and centre. Goes long looking for Corey oh, one out and kick. you're going oh, to be hard. Himself. You're going to be hard pressed to get Corey one on one all day. I reckon he stood on his own foot then, Joel. Yeah, I think you'll be right. Um, yeah. As Pisani gives away the free kick, and Corey, they were, uh, they've were they thrown him forward, so they've done a few positional changes in Newtown. We've got Laurie and Corey up forward. We've got, it looked like uh, Sheehan was a loose man in down back, but uh, looking dangerous now is without Jay Bet, Corey comes in. Must need a goal in Newtown, and he puts it straight through the middle. Good start. Fantastic start for Newtown. Do you reckon Corey and Prasani now will be just chatting about who's got the best beard? It would be a beard off, <laughs> yeah. I think so. <laughs> yep. Good start there to Newtown. One goal, two to Colac yet to score. And if the 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 uh, dew kickers is an indication, all the scoring was done to our left. Yeah, so the wind has somehow stopped uh, or just dropped off. Um, well, if you look at the, the edge banner they're blowing, it's blowing the belly out of it, isn't it? Well, it's either that or just Newtown are at it first at yeah, the moment. Yeah, they're so. just getting first use, aren't they? Again, that, that move of Sheehan going They're for the centre bounce against... Uh, jump. Got it. Out of the middle. Oh, good pick up there for Prasani. Goes wide. No one really out there for him. Leading in the race is McCorkle. That's of the Ash variety. Can he see it over the boundary line? Because he'd be happy with that, and he does. He beats the, uh, the run of Nick Lynch. Yeah, it's... Uh funny old day out here. There's not much atmosphere out there at the moment, yeah, is there? And the crowd is very disappointing. Yeah, I thought it is this a little bit. Chock a block. Absolutely. Maybe. You go, mate? Well, no, that's what I was going to say. Maybe they spotted the black truck and thought we'd better keep away. <laughs> <laughs> Paul gets thrown in. Learson gets it on his boot. Have Goes long. Have a look at this. You wouldn't read about it. Oh. One step goal oh, and he uh, comes that. back to Haunt Newtown straight away. <laughs> Wow, that's uh, when you talk about effective disposal. It was just, a, you know, it was almost like he's just kicking it forward, and it's just gone straight through the middle. It was Got almost his first touch. He's been around the ball, as you said. Yeah. He had three on him. Yep. He hasn't been able to clear it. Goes back to, uh, goes back to the fact that Breeze has just took that ball. Yeah, it and did. Uh, it carried an extra ten so, metres for uh, sure. Yeah, great, great, uh, great goal there by Leeson. and just showing how much da how dangerous he can be on the. Uh, Okay, right, Dale, one scoring shot to six and the yeah. score's oh, a level. it'd be blowy. It'd yeah, be blowy a bird, too. Yeah, <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. That'll be it. That'll be the it. Truck would, the truck would have struggled to stay down there. I'd back Leopold against South, actually. Yep. Ball goes up. As again, Sheehan jumps high. Can't get his hands first to it, though. Ball goes now. Falls to Garner. Garner flicks it over to Monaghan. Oh, sorry, that's Black. Black gets his foot to it, kicks it long. One on one's Kerman and uh, McGuan. It's going to be a free, battle all day, that kick. one. An umpire has spotted that, and he said, You've got your arms all over, McGuan. Uh, and it's going to be a tough kick for, from there, but uh, the way he's been slotting them, you, yeah, you exactly. wouldn't put it past him. You'll just have to hang it out to the left a little and let, let the wind take the rest. Look, this, the only bloke you'd, you'd be over here is um, Levi Dare. Yep. If I was him, I'd push right in front of the typo. Because that's much. a big chance it could come right across the yeah. face. They have been kicking it from this pocket today, actually. McGuan comes in, the leading goal kicker for the league. On 28, isn't he? He is. He just puts it up, lets the wind do the rest. Didn't come back. No. Not quite. Not quite. Might have dropped off a bit the wind, I think. In for a minor. Back to you, Milk. Put one point the difference. Newtown had been on their bike right from the start. Really a must-win game for them to stay uh, stay in contact with the five, really, for Newtown, to not have three losses in a row. So, uh, Jared McCorkle doing the kicking out. He was up forward a minute ago. <laughs> Gets, so covers some ground, he does. <laughs> yeah, he goes out to the outer side. Oh, oh, big fly there from Crooks. Almost takes the mark and puts a knees into his teammate's back. 
Comes out wide. Well done. Higgins. Higgins, I reckon that was. Yep. I was just going to say is that Higgins comes over to Tyler George, we who can run. Quick. We know he's quick, Goes mate. forward, open, chops it off. Happy to see it over the boundary line. Yes, he is super quick, Tyler George. Or George Tyler, as I was calling him. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> It'll be interesting to see how Newtown, and, um, when we watched Colac and West, West was able to still expose Colac a little bit on the outside. Yep. And we know one thing about Newtown, they got runners. And they got quick oh, runners. That was very clever. <laughs> that was very good out of the corner of the eye. <laughs> Braddock, speaking of runners, gets it over. McMahon now breaks the pack, chip short. Forbes can't quite get it. Oh, McMahon, funnily enough, follows up his footy. Feeds back to Braddock. He, in turn, feeds back to... McCorkle, I'm yeah, going to say, yeah, it gets it over yeah. to Higgins on that left boot, falls short. Bouch can't quite oh. trap it, gets it over. Laurie gets it forward. George, one-on-one, -on -one, gets it to the ground. Sweeping up nicely now is Crooks as he gets it on his left boot. He goes forward, looking for Lynch, who seems to be shoved out of it, but umpire says play on. Perkins picks up. He goes after Goodwin. Goodwin finds his man Oh, he has Foster. Foster wheels around, not oh. a great kick. He can't get to it. Laurie follows up. He runs over the footy. Braddock oh. goes onto it. Can he slot it? He oh. doesn't. He puts it across the face. Jesus. They had all the play there, Newtown, and they just couldn't capitalise, unfortunately. Well, I'm not keeping stats on Braddock, but he had a ton of the ball, hasn't he? It's very different to the last game we saw him play, I'd say. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's steering ball into the middle of the ground. Who's that little... That, uh, Bouch. Bouch, Bouch has yep. picked it up. He's found his teammate in McFarlane. The, he's another racehorse. They're getting plenty of ball, plenty of use. Well, yeah, it goes back to what I was saying earlier. So, at, at Colac and West, Colac smashed him in the stoppages. Oh, he dishes it off, goes to Sheehan. Sheehan against the breeze. He's brought Pots it, back. it up, he's brought, brought it, it back. back. It's another one. Wow, eh? This is a great start from Newtown. Wojcinski will be very happy with the way they've come out here. The uh, Colac are in the heels a, a, a little bit here, I think. Yeah, it does seem that way, and uh, the spread. The spread is what's getting Colac at the moment. On the outside, they're, uh, they're, they're, they're dishing off, they're playing on, yep. and uh, they've got they've got Colac on the back foot. Uh, very interesting to see them start this way, to be honest. As it is, 2-1, oh, sorry, what have we got? 2-3-15. Got to tighten it's up on Braddock. One, one, Simpkins on to him now, comes out of the middle, goes to Garner. Garner's kicked. At the feet of Carmody. Can't quite pick it up. Lynch is there. Carmody dishes off. Almost to his, his teammate there in spokes. Can't pick it off. Loose ball. Braddock again leads in the race. Picks it up. Gives it to his teammate in McCorkle. McCorkle goes wide in the sheen direction. Can he pick it up? He does. Keeps it in play. Goes down the line. Looking for Bill Laurie. Goes past him. Picked up by Forbes. Gets away the quick handball. Been dacked. And been dacked. <laughs> oh, play on. It. No. Goes back. Probably a good call, that. Yeah. <laughs> Forbes has looked very lively early. Yes, isn't he? He's, uh, he's moving a lot better than what when we saw him at Grovedale. He looked, he actually looks fit. Have a look at him. Yeah. He's a good-looking rooster, the old Forbes. <laughs> Dad, my, just ask him. Got a couple of mirrors at his joint, too, just quietly. <laughs> Luke Forbes goes into the pocket for Simons. Simons can't quite bend down and get it. Got a couple of colleague players there to beat, one of those being Fedley. And uh, the umpire says, nah, give it to me. We'll have a ball up. A couple of promising signs from you. Sheen in the ruck. I like the move against the, uh, the two more sturdier lads from Colac. You, you'll probably get them around the ground. Absolutely. And it comes out the Ooh. back. Or tried to crash his way through as Perkins. But it comes over the top to his teammate. Uh, sorry, his opponent there. Josh Black dishes off the handball. Goes to Buchanan. Ca goes over to Khan Beckett. Former Irrawarra coach who delivers it straight down the throat of his opponent in Ash McCorkle. Oh, he's put his mate into trouble. Put his there. mate under trouble, but he's good at over to a good one. My mate. Little. Uh, the only reason he's, he's your mate is you look at him eye to eye. He's he can my look, mate. You see him eye to eye. Good, good one. <laughs> go, mate. Go. Good one goes long. McCorkle oh. stands strong and takes a great grab. Uh, really uncontested, I suppose, exactly. though, in, in all that. He chips chips to Forbes. He gets pushed underneath and Umboy says, play on. Pisani goes in after it. He looks to switch play. What's he got on in front of him? He has Cam Newton, but uh, he's put it on the full. He's yeah, put he it on the full, and they are a little bit flustered. McFarlane. Sheepers. Deep in the pocket. Looks to, to throw oh, a balk. He does. does. Candy Stands man. up. Puts it on the full. <laughs> <laughs> I was looking to see the goal. Yeah, up. Where did she go? Well, she didn't move. Uh, no. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, she didn't move. Well, then yeah, that's always just confused move. me there because he had it in the goal square. So, <laughs> What's he doing? It's all kinds of... Uh, oh. 
shenanigans going on out there at the moment. So Learson, deep into the pocket. Umpire calls him play on. He goes long down the line. Oh. Not much on, and it's Oof. touched over the line there as the Colac player. Levi, Levi, Levi Dare. Dare. Couldn't quite trap it, and it goes in out of play. He's a big boy, isn't he? Yeah, it's a long way down to those toes. <laughs> Spinning ball comes in. Look at the wind drag that across. Dare drives a fist into it. Gets Gains about 30 metres. Boundary line will be the winner here as Goodwin tries to keep it in play. Gee, that's a deep boundary over there. It keeps well, going, mate. Yeah, it does, old, doesn't it? Oh, Westy's wing. Yeah. There's a story in itself, isn't it? Absolutely. Again, the spinning ball. The wind gets hold of it again. Tends it towards the Tigers' goal. Veal on this occasion. Dumps it out. Dispossessed. Is that uh, Dare trying uh, to crash his Monaghan, way through? Monaghan. Gee, lucky he backed into that. He He's did too. Plays on immediately, Monaghan. Has he got a teammate? He's looking for him. He does. He finds him in Jake Carmody. Very lively customer, Jake Carmody. Absolutely. The outer side pops it up. He's got Leeson sitting at the back. One, oh. two, doesn't take it. But the back, dishing it off is Sheehan. Bouncing ball. Back to Carmody. Can't trap it. Got a free kick out of it. Tripped. I don't think that's Carmody. I think that is... I'm going to say that's Fedley. Oh, I can't even see. No, I reckon it's Jake Carmody. I saw a two on his back. Did you? Yeah. Where's Jake Carmody then? <laughs> oh, I might be wrong. Anyway... We'll say Carmody. Chip short. He finds, oh. he finds spokes, but he can't trap it. Falling away there was Hocking. Hocking gets it forward. Oh. Tyler George on his oh. bike. Can oh. run. Oh. Just gets Look it over. This. Forbes is winning the chase. This will test Look out his bounce. strings. He can't get it down just a little bit. Gets it forward. He leading in pursuit of Oborn. Colac win out, though, with the two-on-one, and they pump it forward. Goodwin won't take a backwards step. He gets it punched away from him as Braddock comes back onto the ground off the bench. He jumps on it. Colac player in there. Oh. Can't quite get it. McVilly. He gets it back over. New Tango forward, and Goodwin uh, gets it spoiled as it goes out of play. So... We uh, the score at the moment two three fifteen one one seven. Yeah, the, if uh, if they're going to use the wind at all, the Tigers they need to get on their bike and they need to get numbers to the footy. Trying to crash his way through, I didn't quite see who that was for Newtown. Picked He's off on not. that occasion by Simpkin, gets it out wide, bouncing ball into the path path of Lynch, can't quite pick it up. Still in play, tackle there I reckon was from. Well, I can't quite work out the new template. It's a long way away. Yeah, always the way. I reckon mate, it was Higgins. I reckon it was Higgins. Yep. He's wearing 37, is he? Yep. yep. Yeah. Ball gets thrown back in and tossed out of play yet again. So a couple of key matchups here. We've got Monaghan and McMahon. Perkins and Learson will be one to watch all day. Simons and Veal now. Veal wins it down. Trapping it there was... I th I'm going to say Black. He couldn't yeah, quite move Josh. it on. And uh, passed upon by about two Newtown, three Newtown guys in the end. And the umpire wants a ball up. He throws it back up. Simons and, and Veal. Perkins going third man up, which has been effective for him in the past. You're going in there is Learson. He gets a handball out. No, not as far as Baxter. Baxter goes long through the middle. Danger. Big ball this oh, one. Coming through his really? hocking. Can't quite trap it. Getting over was Corey. Bouch gets dispossessed. Corey goes back in and there's Baxter. He goes Look at this. long. He's got Braddock all on his own. He decides to stop and prop. It's a big kick from there. And uh, I reckon I'll back him in. He's got beautiful skills, Braddock, when, he's, when he has the chance to, sh to use them. He's he about 45. When he kicks it, he'll be probably just inside the 50. We saw Sheehan kick one from about there earlier on in the day. The wind, as we said, is... Doing some funny things at the moment. Braddock puts it on his boots, gets almost a distance and knocked over the line. We'll give that to Rushed. Rushed, I the think. The Indian, Rashid. 2 4 16, Newtown, 1 1 7. Colac. Colac. Lockie Simpkin goes straight down the middle. Finds his teammate in Dylan Fedley. He's got a half back, gives it back to Simpkin. Umpire's paid 50. What was that for, Milk? I'm guessing it must have been for stepping over the mark because there was nothing else happened. Mmm. Uh, it's, an, uh, it's an overrated decision, that, I reckon. Unless they're well and truly over it. If they step over it, just get on with it. Healthy 50. wondering why he keeps handballing Fedley. Gives it over to Crook. Crook puts it out in front of O'Dwyer. That's his first touch, I would think. We yep. may have missed one in Jake. Jake O'Dwyer puts it out. Oh, good mark to uh, Jake Carmody. This will just about suit him. 
Yes, and he likes he pops the ball on the ground. He's going to be he's not passing this one off, mate. I wouldn't have thought so. No. <laughs> Player of his uh, capabilities, he can probably kick him from the, the car park if he wanted to. Leeson oh, provided dear. a lead. So did so too did Lynch. He's ignored both of those. So when he comes. Close to the man on the mark. Jake Carr, but he pops it up. The wind needs to do a bit of work here. Good fist over the line there by Sheehan. Put that one down to Rush for Colac as well. Minor score. One goal, two they are. Do we have a leading stats, stats man on the ground there, well, Phil? Well, I reckon it's probably uh, Nathan Braddock at this stage. I reckon he's had about seven touches. Beautiful. Good work. Kick out. On that occasion, was that Higgins? I can't quite pick him at the with the long hair. Or is there's that a, Bill Laurie back there? Of them. Uh, no, I'm going to say that's... I uh... know, oh, well, it's, it's Kermond. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't get him at all. Comes out. Oh, good mark on that occasion to Perkins. Gets the handball off quickly. Forbes is a target. Goes back and gets it. Dishes off the quick handball. Colac leading here. Get over. The uh, ball comes out to Ryan Monaghan. Needs to get more of it. Veal comes over to Crook. Crook on the left. As he does, he's got no one. So he kicks it in the open spaces. Oh! oh. Learson. Wow, I'll oh, tell you what. No. I'll tell you what. If, if someone like we saw at Grovedale got four weeks in Bogan, that was worth its weight in weeks as well. He has absolutely taken his head off there. It's uh, getting a bit fiery here too. Newtown looked to go into bat for Baxter. That was uh, not nice to see. Interestingly, though, the... They're not going anywhere near Lisson. They're all around them. It's the boys in the, the spot fire otherwise. Yeah. Wow. Big deal. <laughs> Newtown play on. As Baxter's in the hands of trainers, he looks like he's holding the jaw. McMahon gets it. He goes long, uh, short, should I say. Finds Laurie. Laurie swings around on his left boot as Jay Bet just prettiest, walks straight across Prettiest there. water boy I've seen today. <laughs> <laughs> Ball gets in. Corey goes in after it on his feet. Going in there is Simkin. He can't trap it. As the heat just, uh, the, the spot, spot fires have ceased and the, the ball fine. gets... Um, yeah. I've just been watching him as he went off. He'd, yep. um, the uh, train had a look at him and he Dangerous hit, up. though. Oh, a yeah. Very dangerous. The ball was behind his back at the time. His hands were kind of... Interesting I'll see what happens with that yeah, one, mate. Yeah, I'd say so. Ball goes up. Field gets probably impeded over his shoulder. Umpire calls play oh, on. Too. Ball goes through. Oh. Perkins keeps his feet. Learson falls over. So Perkins wins that one's out. Against McMahon, who's starting to get his hands more on the footy. Just a short little chip. Can't quite find McCorkle. Running away with it was Colac. Simkin. Simkin, he gets his hands oh. on it, but just a nice oh, little pluck by Perkins as well. Perkins has men on in the middle. Finds McFarlane, throws that customary balk that he has. He gets in, looking for options. He goes Got forward him. again, and Forbes yeah, leading out. Great one. hit. Great mark. Yeah, that was like a... Bold Lily Court Marsh, that wasn't it? It was when uh, he's on, stock standard. When he's on, he's dangerous, Luke Forbes. Forbes has that oh. little left boot, goes forward, can't find Corey. He's going to go over the back. Hawking can't run onto it and it trickles over I for another. It's still behind, behind the Forbes. It is. Clear Certainly it was. Yeah. Simpkin has the ball in the square. He's the, the man that does the kicking duties back there. Goes out wide. Oh, Forbes is going to chop this off, and he does. Target was Buchanan, but Forbes chips it off. Tate gets the kick. Oh, oh, good spoil there on that occasion by Dylan McCarthy. Round the body. The foot race on here. Josh Black and Goodwin. Umpire's blown a whistle. Was that a boundary? Or was, yeah, it was a boundary. Yep. Jeez, Luke Forbes would have had quite a few Oof. touches as well, I'd say. Uh, oh, yeah, he's, he, he's been right up there. Um, and and Matt, George is the other one we're not studying. With Tyler him George. Well Matt McMahon starting his hands onto it as well. That's a massive job for young McCarthy to be on, on Forbes. Yeah. Ball gets kicked forward there by Spokes as he holds his jaw after getting a little clip on the way through as well. Let's just hope they're a bit tougher than the umpires. Yeah, I'd say so after what we saw <laughs> the, the other night, night in the <laughs> AFL. You would not want to go near them with, in, a, with a feather, I would say. in a golf cart. You're kidding me, aren't you? They would not get out of a plastic bag. <laughs> Never want to, imagine that bloke with a hangover. He'd have to go, go home in an ambulance. <laughs> Ball gets <laughs> thrown back in. Simon's in there now versus it looked like McGuan that time. Pounced on upon Oof. it was there. Oh, McFarlane, good he gets his hand t yep. head taken off by Beckett, and he gets the free kick. Uh, McFarlane goes back. He looks to switch play, not this time. Umpire asks him. Hurry it up a little bit there, mate. He goes long down the yes. line. He has Hocking in support. Big grab there by Colac. Yeah, he's paid it. Yep. Can't quite see the, f the, the number there, about 200 metres away from it, it feels like. Yeah. But I'm going to say well, that's Fedley. Fedley. Yeah, I reckon it's Fedley. Fedley now. 
Looking to get Kolak back into attack. He goes short. Oh. McFarlane looked to chop it off. Not a great kick, to be honest. Braddock gets his hands on to again. He yeah, goes he through is, the middle. Forbes must smell today because he has got no one on him. Just does a cheeky little left boot out to Corey. They run the old Pagan's paddock and there's no one on inside the 50. So Corey goes back. Doesn't find his man. Dare gets it. Gets the footy. Falls now to Spokes. Spokes gets it off to Learson. Learson kicks long. But it's all Goodwin as he looks to play on. He goes short. Never really that. Never know how it's oh. going to go off his boot with Goodwin. <laughs> <laughs> as Colac chop it off. He goes falls now. Gets yeah, they're getting the numbers back. To Sheehan. Absolutely. Higgins one out. He can't quite grab it. Lynch spoils. He goes in after it again and gets it on his boot. Up by says holding him. the ball. Couldn't quite get his boot on it. Great tackle by Lynch. Yeah, Lynch now wheels around. Puts it out wide in front of McGuan. Up he goes. Dukes to it. Can't hang on. Good work there. Ta taken away. Kerman. Kerman, it was. Yes, the three of them look the same. <laughs> ball comes out and it's in the front of Josh Black. Black on outer wing. Goes, oh, low. Shocking pass to Spokes. And... Uh, they're just not using the disposals the well. have been Shocking. quite poor. We're, we're Newtown is smashing them with disposals. Yeah, they're quite a lot more pinpoint, and uh, they're letting themselves down, Kyle, because it's not like they've been under. It, it, it could come back to perceived pressure, I suppose, because they haven't been under a lot of pressure no, when they they've haven't. had the footy. No. Twenty-six minutes into this term, so nearly over. Nearly over, and it's uh, it's been all Newtown. There's no doubt about that. Quickly, uh, good start to Bell Park, three-seven to Leopold. three straight. Leopold four-two to one-one. We know that one. Joey's 6-4 to nothing. <laughs> St Albans, 4-2 to one goal. And St Mary's, 7-4 to zero. Simons gets it down. In there is Spokes. He gets wrapped up. Umpire says, that's enough. Give it to me. There's a little bit of fire. Ankles, uh, Spokes leading, is, ankles uh, leading Drysdale. Getting up a little bit gingerly over there. Umpire balls it up. Going in there is Dare. He's lovely tap over to O'Dwyer. O'Dwyer gets his ball smothered. Falls to Kelly. Kelly gets it over. Kerman, great spoil on McGuan. Going to be a great matchup that yeah, one exactly. all day. Coming over there is Diamond. Diamond can't get his hands on it, and uh, I think that's gone out of play. Diamond. Diamond. Is that Isa? I'm going to get. I'm going to run with that. I thought it was Dement. Yeah, Dement. <laughs> <laughs> ball like gets thrown in. Kerman, probably undersized there in that throw in. Winning it, though, is McVilly. Getting it back to Kerman, who's had a great start to this year. Gets it over to Baxter, who seems he's, to have recovered from the hit. Dare goes down. McVilly gets his hands on it. Comes to Goodwin, who feeds back. He has Braddock. Braddock gets wrapped up. Umpire really? says... Oh, hang on, hang on there was an audio, that. earlier kick. Lucky. Going back to Goodwin, it looks like. Lucky there, Newtown. Yeah. Very lucky late in this piece. Goodwin. Want to give the handball away, then. As Sammy Lockhart sticks his snoz over the bed thing. Goes to Perkins. Perkins down the line. A big fly. At the back. There's none other than McFarlane. Oh, he's quick. The race he's horse. quick. He's, he's going to beat the clock. Takes a bounce. He's burned him off. He's burned him off. He'll go all the way. He's going to go all the way. He's had two. He's going to have three. He's got... Over the top. Over the top. No. It's just, he was, point, he was to told off. to go. McCorkle told him, kick the goal. Great Didn't work. call for it. He pointed straight to the goals. Fair. Fantastic goal to Dane McFarlane. That's where you're going to get Colac today, I feel. Just on the on the um, the spread, Newtown for pace would be one of the quickest teams in the comp. It's uh, they didn't get to use it against Grovedale because it was a lot of yeah. wet contested footy. You got, you're already this quarter. You've seen George. You've seen McFarlane. They get the footy. They tuck it under the arm and they Back, go. Baxter Braddock. Those, Back, yeah, yeah, that's those right. Guys. Yep. yep. Give them space, and they will do some damage as we've seen this quarter. As we've got three, five, twenty-three. This game's over. No, nah, come yeah, on, no, mate. Yeah, no, it's over. <laughs> this game's over. Sheehan gets oh, it's up. It's on. It's on in the middle. It's on in the middle. Here we got the Kelly combatants. and McVillian. Who do you reckon it is? Yeah, they've yeah. done this before. Yeah. As they're throwing. You watch the fight, Milky. There's a um, siren. Says, yeah, great time for a siren as well. These two are going to be at it all day. We picked it early. Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> they don't mind. They, there's never been a report with the two, but there has been bloodshed many a time. <laughs> As Newtown, as you, you'd say, Milky took oh, all absolutely. points that quarter. 3 5 23, Colac 1 2 8. A very flat Colac, a very wasteful Colac, and a really uninterested Colac, to be honest. It's exactly right, mate. It's been all Newtown. They've had all the running. They've, they want it. The, 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 the game is being played on their terms, and that's the way they like it. We'll come back for the second quarter, and we'll get some uh, the inside of what goes on inside this Phil Shaw's head. <laughs> It's much better. They were very much muffled last on last occasion. Interestingly, again, we see it again. Josh Sheen going for the, the centre. He's only going the centre jewels. 
And, yep. then, and yeah. then, uh, then just gets on his bike. He's rated as the best ruckman at Newtown in this centre, just because he can jump so high, yep. um, as you'll probably see now. Up against Veal, up they go. Veal gets up early, wins the tap, knocks it down. Lynch tries to get through, then ball's dispossessed. Gone, says the umpire. Free kick. McCorkle. Across to McCorkle, who's in the guts as well. Decides to dish it off to Sheehan. Stats racking up, goes straight oh, down nice. the guts. He's got one. Oh, oh. I couldn't. I thought he had him then. I thought he had little Mick Foster. Goes back and gets it, does he, though? And is that a goal? I reckon it is. Oh, he's touched. 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 Oh, right on the line, it must have been. Another minor score. You've got, got, to, got to use them against Colac. You know they're going to come at some stage. It's just a matter of when, and you've got to make sure that uh, you've got the goals on the board. Simpkin kicks to himself on this occasion. Goes wide. He finds Dwyer. O'Dwyer he is. Takes the mark. Goes wide. Oh, out to his teammate in Newton. Uh, Newton. Caden Newton. Decides to play on. Dishes off the handball. Over to Oban. Oban. Back again to Newton. Getting some help. There's Learson. What can he do? Comes out the back. Is that Newton again? Yeah. Goes into centre half forward. Crook got two to beat. Out the back, is that Goodwin? A yeah, little Goodwin. Little Goodwin gives it over to little Matty McMahon with all, just all legs pumping. He's gets got it space. out. He's going to run. Here he goes over to Tyler George. Puts it out in front of his leading forward. Let's, doesn't take the mark. Play on as a call. That was Braden Hocking who couldn't take that mark. He's in your kidney, Braden Hocking. Yeah. Comes out. Trapped. To, was that McCorkle? Yeah. Goes towards goal. Always. Minor score. That was McCorkle, wasn't it? Yeah, it certainly yep. was. Kick two behinds. Three yep. seven twenty five, one two eight. Hocking is how old? Was he only seventeen last year? So that'd make him eighteen, something like that. I'd say, yeah, he'd be he'd be eighteen or nineteen. Yeah. Uh, he's not. He's he's uh he's definitely not in his twenties just yet. As the ball gets kicked back in by Simpkin, he finds Buchanan, which I can't recall oh, just saying his say name today. Thing. He gets on his right boot. He gets that spoiled there. Was Rowan. As Brad Ocow gets it off to Goodwin. Goodwin with his little chip. Can't find his little other little mate in George. Going in after it's Buchanan. Oh. George back in after it. He gets it below his knees. He's dangerous, this boy. Gets it on his right boot. It's as good a spot as any. Learson's coming in. Baxter reads it better. Gets it over. Falls to Ash McCorkle. He puts it on his right boot, but it's wasteful. That's why he's at fullback. Get and up it, the other end of the ground. <laughs> and it goes out of play <laughs> for a behind. First quarter stats and uh, Brad Ocow. Topped it with nine on the stat sheet here. Luke Forbes had six touches and for Colac, four to Lewis and four to Monaghan. Yeah, they, they are smashing him around the ground. Jake Carmody kicking that uh, kick out. From the He's gone down the back uh, back end. Finds his teammate in McCarthy. McCarthy tries to get it out of the danger zone. Umpire's blown the whistle. Free kick for holding to Jai Sheehan. He's got it at half forward. Sends it in quickly. Here's the little fella. Tyler George takes a ripper. And he'll uh, 30 metres out. Line him up. He's some sort of, well, pity we didn't have uh, oh pity we sorry, pity we didn't have uh, replay. Because that was a little beauty. <laughs> and he comes. Wobbly old kick. Oh. Oh, probably didn't do the mark the justice no. that it deserved to a minor score. <laughs> Hmm. Simpkin again at full back, the designated kicker. Geez, cribbed up a bit there, the old uh, Joel Corey. <laughs> he's just Looks like he's luck, a fraction he? close, isn't he? Come play on. Comes straight up the guts. Monaghan's a target, doesn't let him down, takes the mark. Gets on his bike, comes out wide, puts it in front of Lynch, needs to get the Dukes out. Good spoil. Is that Higgins, yes, it is. Comes across to uh, Braddock. Braddock by hand to Goodwin. Goodwin down to looking for Tyler George again, but the boundary is going to be the winner. That's uh, nothing like um, Shawnee Higgins, is it? No. Not no, even remotely no, like him. Nothing like him at all. The ball gets thrown back in. Sheehan gets his hands to it. McCorkle can't trap it as it comes to Buchanan, who's starting to try and get an influence this game. Baxter, Newton, one-on-one. -on -one. Baxter has the pace, gets it on his right boot. He goes wide. He's in turn looking for Hocking. He can't win it and goes to Fedley, who feeds back to his Oof. teammate. Gets smothered, though. 
by Hocking. Comes back to Carmody, who finds himself deep in defence. He's nearly kicked the goal for him. He switches. <laughs> he, he finds Simpkin. Simpkin looks oh. to play on. He's got Buchanan, who good, Goodwin pushes up on his mark. Buchanan. Josh Black out here on his own all the time. Yours, mate. Just chips. He finds Black. Oh, yep, he finds Black. Black goes back. <laughs> Once you've cannon. had black, you never go back. Yeah, so they say. <laughs> he goes over. He finds Pisani with the beautifully maintained beard. He goes long to Learson. Learson chip short. He finds... That's McGuan. McGuan with number, number 60, 60 on his back just to throw Newtown out. And us. He goes yeah. short. He finds Learson who's doing some running at the moment. Gets around on his right You're boot. Another short one. I don't care what anyone says, Tristan. You're multi-skilled. <laughs> <laughs> he, push, he pushes forward. Oh. Comes now to Baxter, who's had plenty of it. Gets to McVilly, who looks like to have come off best after that scuffle with Kelly. Going through a dangerous kick. Goes over the top of George's head and goes to Buchanan. He goes over now to Black. Black feeds over to Med, Med, uh, sorry, Simkin. Simkin. Simkin just chips short. This is the Colac we know. He goes over. He looks to Black. He's got Crooks all out on the his lefty. own. Gets on his left boot. He goes to McGuan in the new jumper. Oh. Can't drag it in. Umpire says play on. Probably stiff not yeah, to get it there. there. Kerman feeds back to McCorkle. Cool head on him. Finds Mc, McMahon who just takes that it. That hit the deck, Matty. You it little did. Come on. Great, up. great take on it, though. <laughs> Yes, McMahon goes out wide to Perkins. Perkins has a couple of bounces. Now he's just having a third. Just looking to find an option here. Gets around his opponent. Little chip give. Gets it across. I reckon that was Baxter. Comes into the middle. Oh, Learson. Across the front of Braddock again. Uh, coming through there is Black. He's had a bit of the footy in this quarter. Goes with the left boot. Into centre half forward. Going back and taking a good mark is Monaghan. Ryan Monaghan. Oh, 35 maybe out. So he'd probably have a, have a ping at him. He's, he's walking away with his back to everyone, so he's going to have a shot, Phil. Well, they'd have to. They've only kicked one, so uh, they've got to make him count, don't they? He's not that far. And I don't reckon the wind is as high as we thought it was. We'll see, so won't we? We'll see how he goes, because he's desperately need a goal here, the Tigers. Taking, certainly taking his time. He's got the Dennis Lilly run up. He's back a mile. In he comes. Ryan Monaghan. Distance goes across the face of goal. Two to beat. McGuan tries to take the mark, but it's gone out on the full. He got the distance all right, just not the accuracy. Mm, that's exactly right. So it's Sheehan. Unloads. Brings it out in front of the big black truck. Up they go. Big Lockie Veal takes a good mark. Puts it into the hot spot. Can't Beckett takes a mark. In the side of the square. Gets a handball. Oh. Over to Newton. Newton sends it in. Carmody was the target. Fisted away from him. Corey gives the old don't argue. Gets it across to Simons. Simons goes out wide. He's, oh, he's got, got one space. out there. He he's likes got space, him. Baxter. Baxter. But just uses... He, they probably call that his wing, do they? Because he seems to find plenty he, of room. He, he plays the traditional wing, Baxter. Uh, good spoil there by Learson. Then managed to go back and pick it up. Goes down the line, looking for Buchanan, those little legs pumping. Goes back, very clever little footballer. Drives it in. Uh, McGuan picks it off. Great He's got tackle. one there waiting. He's got Garner there for him, getting the crumbs. Gets a call, goes round the body. Probably should have given it off. I saw Good. Phil. Black was there. Should have given it to him. McCorkle happy to walk it across the line for a rush behind. Yeah, big play that by Colac. You thought they were going to come away with a goal there, but uh, Kerman with a great tackle uh, on McGuan and just held him up. Ball gets kicked in. Goes to Ash McCorkle. He goes long to Simons. He can't get his hands onto it, and it comes to Rowan first. He gets bustled out of play for a boundary throw in. Right on Westy's wing in between the two coaches' boxes. Yeah, there was that on the goal. true wing. Perhaps shouldn't have blazed away there, the uh, the Tiger. He should have spotted oh, his well, man Black that was in the... Black was clear. And yeah, Black was clear. Easy kick. Yep. McCorkle gets it, stops, props, oh. sends a Hail Mary yeah. forward. <laughs> Sheehan can't take the grab. It's spoiled by Fedley. Comes now to Colac. We seem to win it through Veal. He gets it over to McCarthy. 
Measured kick there by Newton. Oh, He's man. got O'Dwyer who stands tall against Baxter. He cooks it a little bit long. Kerman reads it best. And he goes back and looks to play quickly. He goes over to that uh -oh. run machine uh -oh. in McFarlane. There's one thing he knows how to do. He is, gives it space. He's chopped no. off, though, by Blackwell played. No, Black. McMahon goes long. He's got four oh! Can't quite get it, but Laurie's there at his feet. He butters up. He handballs over. Gets it to Hocking. Hocking gets it over now. George is in there as well. Going in there for Colac is Rowan. He hits out to um, Carmody, who's looked like yeah. to be going down back. So they're one short, aren't looks they? Like, well, I don't, I'm not sure if they are. Listen. Yeah, they are. They're one short and forward. They've so, sent extra men back. So they've sent um, Carmody back, which is a really interesting move as he's so dangerous up forward. He goes forward, finds Black, who's getting plenty of it. Little chip. Finds O'Dwyer. He's starting to work his way into the game. He's got McGuan. He's got two to beat. You know Goodwin's going to run back with the flight of the ball. Doesn't have much care for his own safety, Dan Goodwin. And uh, they get the spoil and it goes out of play. He'd be in the team photo. You'd be sitting next to him, wouldn't you? Oh, no. I'd probably be giving him a hug, mate. He's one of my <laughs> favourites. He's one of my favourite players to watch in AFL full stop. He's incredible. Simmons can't get his hands to his foot, the footy. Buchanan's in there getting dirty. Comes to Beckett, who's clean below the legs. Oh. O'Dwyer, not quite. And he gets wrapped up for that. And Simmons dies on top of him. And it's a ball up 60 metres out from the Colac goal. They've lifted a little bit, the Tigers. Well, they needed to. Yeah, they did. They they've needed lift, to. They've lifted a little bit. They're on top uh, of the ladder. Not enough, still not enough. Veal throws a boot at it. Then goes back in after it. Can't trap it. He's getting some help in there from uh, Crooks. Gets over to Learson. His kick smothered. Bouncing ball. Almost over to my little mate in Tyler George. Ball spills. Comes out. Good mark there to Simons. Spin, spits it out into the middle. And he goes to Brock Bouch. In turn, goes across to his mate in Baxter. Down the line. Forbes was the target. Can't quite get there. Carmody back. And defending. Knocks it over the boundary line. Oh, Ten metres around. From the Newtown goal. Lynch is obviously seeing Corey and Forbes running a muck up forward. And he's like, well, Carmody, you're the man to do it. You're the fix-it man. And he's like, put him down there to try and plug the hole because they were very dangerous in that first quarter. Seems to have stemmed the flow just a little. Ball gets thrown back in in the Newtown forward line. Sheehan wins this one. Gets a quick kick out there by Colac. Oof. Forbes gets his hand on it first before Oof. he almost gets his head taken off. Foster weighs up the goals. Puts it on his left, but he can't squeeze it through. And it goes in for another minor score for Newtown. It's all Newtown doing the scoring, though. 3-10, 28. That could come back to bottom as this game goes on. Kick five points straight in this quarter. It will bite him, I he's got. He's just pink Simpkin for going over the line. Well. Go away. This is another <laughs> stupid rule. To me, it, it the impact that has on the game, there should be a, a metre you know, red zone or something. Either that or just don't... Just step ignore it. Oh, just crazy. Anyway, the rules are rules, and up they go. Veal decides, blow that. I'm not going to put any of my mates under pressure, and I'll just smash it through for a minor score. Six straight behind. Six straight behind for the quarter. As Tristan just belts out another one of his little texts to one of his fans. <laughs> <laughs> Goes out wide to Carmody. Text or a Twitter or a Twitter. No, well, Tom O'Dwyer is just asking if we're on the radio frequency to make about the 20th bloke to ask us yeah. today. So, oh, unfortunately. Corey pinches the kick, gets it over to Forbes, round the body. They got that first one for the quarter. Great work. Joel Corey, fabulous stuff. Just a cool head. Yeah, just Carmody tried to kick the ball across the face of goal, looking for his teammate. Corey saw it coming, put a fist in it, smacked it down to Forbes' feet, and he kicked the goal. His first. Yep. Forbes' is first. Yep. Well, he's, had, he's had plenty of it, and he's yes. probably had his hand in all four goals, to be honest. But uh, mark of the second term. He's been super. He's been Absolutely super, Forbes. Yes. Um, obviously, Lynch, um, Coach Lynch needs to have a look at the matchup on that because uh, Forbes is close to best on ground. Yeah, at the moment. As far as, as far as impact Impl goes yep. And, yep. and effectiveness around the footy, he's been right up there. Well, he's had seven touches too, so... Yeah, he'd, he'd, be, he'd be running at about 90% as well, as Brock Bouch wins it straight back into the team after a hamstring injury. Gets to McMahon, who just oh. bodies his man out. Gets it on the boot to that man, Forbes. Gets taken high, and he's going to have a shot 30 out. He is looking very dangerous. It looks as though that Oborn might be on him. And... 
Luke Forbes, I get the, he's the Good best job. at it. He was already de- on his way down before he got touched Nothing. and had his hand to his head. Beautifully sucked the umpire in. Nothing wrong with knowing your no, trade. No, exactly. No, just, <laughs> That's how I got half the, my kicks the, back in the day, Milk. He's the best at it. Best at it. He already had a hold of his head and the guy hadn't touched him how yet. How was McMahon just oh, saying just, to his man, yeah, you know what? Yeah, yeah. Get out of my way. Yeah. Forbes trots in, puts it on his left boot, squeezes it in. He has his second in those many minutes. Newtown go 5 11. over. 41 to a, you could, some would say, a hapless gr- a Colac at the it moment. 1 3 9. As uh, the quarter is ticked over to the 15 minute mark. Well, Col- Colac, we're promising the first 10 minutes, though. So, well, blokes like Buchanan and, uh, and Kane Leeson got plenty of it, but they didn't score. They didn't. They were all getting in the back half, yeah. which is the interesting part of that. And going forward, Kerman, uh, for me, has been one of the inform. Him and uh, who's the man from Joey's? Carson have been the inform yeah, defenders yep, yep. of the league this yep. year. Well, I think he's only had about five goals well, kicked on him. Carson uh, not playing in the league. Yeah. Yeah, so very ball. unhappy, Glenn Wallace. <laughs> ball goes. He always seems to get injured this time of year. Yeah. Foster goes in after. He gets his boot to ball again. Coming out is Braddock. Oborn spoils. Buchanan's there to mop oh, up as he tries to get his team on. But they're hacked upon by the Newtown boys as they're fired up. Corey gets it out to McVilly. McVilly now flicks it back to Corey. Stops, props, gets around. Sorry, that was McCorkle. It was a bit yeah. nimble for Corey. Yeah, yeah. Uh, McVarland no chips beer. short. Oof, there's Corey. There, Corey. It's spoiled out of play. 50, 60 metres out from Newtown's goal, Milky. Yes, and it's all Newtown. They just, uh, as I said earlier, they're playing the game on their terms and Kodak are yet to really put up some sort of defence. Dare and Simons to attend this boundary throw-in. The wind doesn't seem to drag that as far. Dare knocks it down, only as far as Matty McMahon. He gives it across to a teammate. He goes into Forbes. Despoilt. Ball comes out. In the hands of Monaghan. He gets it up to Lynch. Pushes off. Dick oh, gives a handball across to Crook oh. and fumbles. He's got three to beat. Now they'll turn it over. Comes out. O'Dwyer's oh, there. He's wrapped up. Ducks his head and goes right in. The umpire's going to ball this up for sure. Milky, it's like, it's as if Jay Bet being out of the team, there's no indecision about who to kick it to for yeah. Newtown. Yep. Whereas, like, it was always going to be Jay Bet or Forbes. Yeah, yep. Now it's just like, listen, yep. we got you, Forbesy. That's it. We're going to be kicking it to you. And he stood up on the roll. Oh. Dare. His, kick, his uh, tap down goes to Buchanan. Oh, picked off by McFarlane. Goes to the outside of the boot to his teammate in Braddock. Baxter, Baxter sorry. Baxter. He's been really good. Gets it on the wing. Unloads. Out to centre half forward. Forbes is the target, all right. But up high, he was Jai Sheehan. Almost pulled it in. Loose ball at ground level. They're wrestling for it. Massive pack. Umpire circling. Says, give it to me. Freak the uh, ball up, what, 40 metres out from the Newtown goal. Where all the play's been. Where it has, yep. <laughs> it's uh, It's been a completely different tale of two teams. Again, is this year just... The first five or six, so every game we've gone to, the team we've seen previously is a different team yeah. to the one that turns up, yep. Milky. Yep. We're the omen for them all. Yeah. Oh, tell us to piss off soon. <laughs> 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 it's uh, as Colac just don't have anything going for them. Their players, McGuan, you know, I think he's had one kick. Um, yep. Dare gets it down. Corey's there to snap up. Braddock can't keep his oh, feet. And Monaghan. a tackle there is Monaghan. Umpire says play on. Very lucky to get away with it. Buchanan gets it forward. Perkins, who's been solid, oh, takes good. a grab. Going to ground. Looks to play on. Umpire says no, that's fine. Stops and props. He's looking to weigh up his options. He doesn't have much coming towards him. He sees Laurie now. He kicks longer. Going to Corey in a pack situation. He can't get it. Comes to Grant. Sheehan wraps up. Uh, looks like Fedley there. And umpire says, give it to me. We'll have a throw up. Um, yeah, 55 out from throw Newtown. Up. That was the umpire yeah, did last that's night. That's right. He got on the cart. Ball goes back into play. Monaghan gets wrapped up. Comes to... Corey, Looks and he like just Corey, walks yeah. it over yep. the boundary line. Um, Racking up a few stats, Joel. Corey, starting, this to, starting to get a bit more accustomed to the pace of it, I'd say. Slowing it down a lip, little bit. Down. <laughs> Surely that beard must slow him down. Yeah, Spinning sure. ball, it comes in. Ball's knocked down. Doing the, That's good one, was it? Go, gave it across to McCorkle. Gave it across to Matty McMahon. Oh, oh high Sheehan. taking Sheehan. Takes a good mark. He's already got two. He's had an indifferent... No, he's, not, he's only got one. I'm he's sorry. He's had an indifferent start to the season, Sheehan. Today, it looks as though it's... Again, it's the responsibility of yep. throwing him into a situation, saying you've got two big bikes to beat. And I think the ruck duties has kind of freed him up. 
and he's uh, he's looking very lively. He's awake. It's almost like his opponents don't know where he's going. Sheen he's got that. Dobbs. Dobbs it without any difficulties whatsoever as he kicks his second, and this Newtown team just keeps rolling on. Well, I, I was. I'm, I've got to tell you, I was hoping Cole could win for only one reason. To keep me quiet? No, because you sent me a text message three weeks ago that this <laughs> Newtown side wouldn't be beaten. Well, they, they have had been. one since then. <laughs> they haven't they had one since, since then. you sent that message. Well, I mean, we were so talking, now, we were talking before the game. Yeah. Um, I said, Colac, with the team that Newtown have yeah. in, should be a five-goal better team, and they have looked uninterested. They look flat-footed, don't they? Ball goes up. McCorkle, who's had a great half of footy. Goodwin goes crashing in there. McCorkle's the cleanest one. He wins out. Going through his crooks, perhaps. Lynch. He, Lynch, sorry, he gets wrapped up. And the tackling pressure by this Newtown team today is something we haven't seen for a couple of weeks, no, I dare is, say. This is the team you were talk, telling this me about. This is the team I, I that I saw play yeah, Leopold. Yeah, yeah, um, this is that. This the is the free-wheeling. Free yep. Ball gets thrown up again. Perkins, third man up, has been effective in the past. McMahon leads in the chase. Beckett falls mm. over. Comes to Monaghan, who's leading. McMahon goes in again. He gets tripped up. Can't get it to it. He's in under the pack. Monaghan looks to get it out. He's tackled by Bouch. Perkins in on top of him. And Beckett just says, well, I may as well get into this party because it looks like fun. And the umpire says, I'll have a ball up, Milky. He does. Yeah, and I'm just um, wondering how sore Matty McMahon pulls up after every game. Yeah. He's um, a cracker. He's, he is in the interleague squad at the moment. Yep, standing his ground. Simmons gets smashed over the top by Dare, but only goes as far as McFarlane. McFarlane round the body. Oh, he's oh, been free dragged kick. down, surely. surely. <laughs> free kick against Simkin for dragging his opponent down, but he gets away with it. As a famous, Open. As a famous commentator once said, it's like um, Rex Hunt reeling in a mile in there. Yeah. <laughs> he goes out wide, does Jake Carr, but he finds Levi Dare. Dare at half back. They've got to set something up here, Colin. Nothing just on. Said, there's nothing on. They just said, this will just be a, a kick in hope. So it goes back. To the luckiest bloke out there in Lockie Simpson. They've got some numbers now. They've goes, got some numbers. He comes out there. He, oh, he's Black. got Black. He, Black will take the mark here unattended. Jay Bett might chip in and mark this one. But Learson, he's got some time. But he needs to get on his boot quickly because he's got his Tyler George <laughs> yeah, chasing him. him. Goes out, puts it in front of Crooks. He should, if he take the mark, it's not a bad spot for a left footer to be having a kick against his breeze. Great effort by McCorker, though. Made him earn it. Yep. And uh, he's just made sure he's pushed him as deep into that pocket as possible. He's probably <laughs> marked it about five metres from where yeah. McCorkle's <laughs> marking the spot. Sucked the umpire in. Uh, did he what? Not hard to do. <laughs> Crooks comes around on the wind. Look at the wind drag that away. Big looping left footer. At ground level. Was that Buchanan? Was. Tried to sneak it through. He gets his opponent wrapped in, in Simons, wrapped up in a tackle. Have a boundary throwing. Two metres around from the Colac goal. Tough pocket to kick it from that uh, scoreboard side there, mate. I can't see your score. What's the scoreboard? Uh, yeah, I'll oh. tell you, mate. 6-11 plays 1-3. I thought you had on the screen. I should do. 1-3. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Colac need a goal. Bottom of the pack. Perkins gets it clear, but it's only Ooh, as far. Probably got him over the oh, shoulder there. I reckon he might have. Was that Garner? Yeah, it was Jared Garner. Yep. But got managed to get away with it, Newtown. Good luck to them. Yeah, if you can yeah, get away with it, exactly. better for you. Right in front of the, uh, is it the Jim McLean Stadium? It certainly Jim is. Mc yeah. Pavilion. Comes out the back. Dishes off to Simpkin. Looks for a teammate. Oh, oh. Kerman. Kerman not only Wowie. takes the mark, he gets a free kick as well. <laughs> oh, so he got, Does he get two kicks there? Oh, I hope so. Let's <laughs> mark him down for two there, <laughs> Phil. Kerman goes wide. Monaghan, the danger man. Just lost his footing for a split second there. He was away if he could have just got back on his feet. Goodwin and Higgins take it over with Monaghan. But, uh, yeah, Kerman, um, from what he's just taken another step this year. Yeah. And uh, he takes the best player in the forward line every week. He's, he's normally undersized and he's been doing the job. Comes to ground by Veal. McMahon leads the race and gets it on that big right boot of his. He goes long. Laurie can't quite trap it. Going back is Pisani. Grabs it in the one mitt. He goes forward, looks for uh, Rowan. He gets wrapped up and comes to Hocking, who gets it on Here his boot. Go. Looks like Laurie's one out if he can get his hands on it. Well done there by Crooks. He kind of, yeah. he got fouled. Yep, free Fa kick, sorry. Fouled. He got fou <laughs> fouled. The other word, fouled. Fouled. <laughs> Not fouled, fouled. Yeah. Fouled at the top of the field. Crooks at, at in the halfback flank, where it's been the majority of this, this quarter. Been going some 24 minutes. Kick doesn't find a target. As they've done all day. Corey dishes off the handball. 
Oh, good work there from Matty McMahon at ground level. Learson's in there against him as well. Comes out to Garner. Garner's uh, handball smothered. Back to Matty McMahon. Round the body he goes. Puts it into Forbes. Oh, Forbes. He'll Great love kick. this. Great talk kick. About, you're talking about blokes who love being in the right side for a left footer. Oh, this is <laughs> as bad as good as it gets. Yeah. And he has a great leg on him. So why wouldn't you back yourself in the game he's played today? And he's going to kick inside 50 by the time he gets it. So Forbes, hard up against the fence. But the, as, as old Lou Richards used to say, the right side for a left footer. <laughs> he wheels around. Oh, oh, it doesn't make good contact. Going back, almost taking a mark there was Corey. Hands across the top to O'Dwyer. O'Dwyer goes very wide across to Black. Josh Black has it. Half back. Looking to set something up here. Flat, very flat footed the Colac side. He gives it across to Jake Carmody. Carmody has to get around Simons, oh. has touches it on the ground. Little chip give across to Simpkin. Simpkin. Unloads in the Dwyer direction, but a good mark taken by Baxter. He plays on, goes towards goal, and the wind gets hold of it. It's a oh. good one. Good goal there, to Aaron Baxter. I'm pretty sure if you asked him, he'd say what bump. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> That's right. Now nah, this new town team, they're playing like uh, a team that wants to be amongst five. I mean, they're, it's it's a they're playing a great brand of footy. Yeah, absolutely, mate. Yes. But, uh, Again, you said two weeks ago, wasn't it? Yeah, Try and that. pick your top five and see who you leave out. Yep. And this this is the issue. You're just seeing the the balance. You're playing. This is fifth playing first. That's right. And in any given day. Yep. In this league at the moment, it's fantastic viewing. Ball gets thrown up. Sheehan jumps very high, gets over the top. Braddock overruns the footy. McVilly just goes bang. He takes his own man out. Uh, O'Dwyer cleans it up. He gets it over to Lynch. Oh. Little dolly of a kick. Not really what they needed. Perkins goes in. He cracks in. Going after it is Black. On his tail is Dement, who's done a good job on him. And McCorkle just bustles it out of play. Right in front of the scoreboard as this computer is absolutely rubbish, Milky. Oh, turn it all off and start again, mate, I reckon. Yep, great. Josh Black uh, has been working overtime. Worked this hard quarter, this he? quarter, he has. Over the top goes McGuan. Puts it in the Lynch direction. Can he help him out? Ball, he's going, the boundary line's going to be the winner here because we uh, a bit of argy-bargy between Lynch and Kermond. Nothing serious, though. Spinning ball. Over the top goes Sheehan. Puts it in the direction of Braddock. Braddock gives it across. Good hands on that occasion. I haven't quite picked that young fellow out that he gave it to. McVilly comes out. Oh, good work. There it is. All right on the siren. Right in front of us, the bloke with the longest shorts in the uh, GFL. Takes the mark in Joel Corey. That's a half, mate. That's a half. And it has been one-way traffic. <laughs> one-way mean, traffic. It's in, it's It's been... Almost strange to watch. Yeah. Um, it, it just looks like a timid Colac team. I hate yep. to say it. Yep. Um, Seven eleven plays one goal three. I mean, the you can go the score with eighteen scoring shots to four. Yeah, that's.